Hands together. Ari, hands together. Hands together. Yeah, hands together. Good. Very good. So you look at Noah. Hands together. Close our eyes. Very good. All right, let's pray. Lord, thank you for this day. I just pray, Lord, that you help the children to learn from the verse this morning in Philippians. And we um, thank you, Lord, for your precious blood. Uh, through you, we have eternal life. And we pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Very good. Oh, but who remembers what we learned last week? Here's a hint. <laughs> what did we learn about last week? What? Yeah, nice. Simon, what did we learn about last week? The armor, the armor of God. Who remembers some of the pieces? Some of the pieces of the armor of God. Breastplate of righteousness. Very good. What was another one? No? Sword of the spirits. Hey, you got to put your hands up, guys. What's another one? What's another one? You had another one? No, that was yours? What's another one? Shield of faith. Very good. So we got a few, didn't we? We got the belt of truth, feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. And one more. Last one was the... Yeah, you got to put your hand up. Kids club. <laughs> I listen to the helmet of salvation. Okay, but this week, think on these things. Think on these things. That's what we're talking about, Philippians. What you think about. What's this? Oh, look up here. Yeah, this is talking about your mind, how your brain works. Sometimes your brain is like clocks, isn't it? Tick, 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 sticking away. Your mind is a very powerful thing, isn't it? You know, sometimes when you think positive things, you're very happy. What happens when you think negative things? It can make you sad. Sometimes you, what you think about can affect you physically as well. It can affect your body. That's why there are positive things you want to think of and there are negative things you want to think of. So today we're reading from, oh, it looks like a very long one, isn't it? Philippians 4.8. Oh, it's very repetitive, you can see here. It says, finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true. So you can see how these words repeat themselves. Whatsoever things are true. Whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these things. So this is where I get my title from. You want to think on these things. So the Bible tells us the sort of things to think on, what our mind should be really preoccupied with, not the negative things, not sad things. Sometimes there are sad things in life. Sometimes you have to deal with them, grumpy things. Hmm? You know about grumpy things, don't you? But you want to think on the things that the Bible talks about here. True, honest, just, pure, lovely, good report, virtue and praise. So let's talk quickly about what each one of these things mean? True. Oh, sometimes in a courtroom, I'll get people to swear on a Bible, make sure they're telling the truth. So whatsoever things are true, here we are in a courtroom. This is probably a lawyer here, or a judge, and somebody is swearing, hey, I'm going to tell the whole truth, nothing but the truth. Okay, so finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, Whatsoever things are honest. What's this? Honest. Sometimes when you make a deal with somebody, shake hands. You say, I promise to do something. Honesty. Okay? Whatsoever things are honest. Whatsoever things are just. Who knows what just means? Does anybody know what just means? You know? Like a judge? Yeah, a judge has to be just. Who else knows what just means? Steffi. Brave? No, no, not brave. So just, if you think of justice or a judge, it means when things are fair. See, so this is a judge's gavel. Sometimes when he makes an order, he's going to make things fair. And this is why in justice, you see the scales. Why? Because the punishment has to fit the crime. Isn't it? If it's fair, so just 
means fair. Whatsoever things are just. Oh, what do we have here? There's some nice clear water. Isn't it? Whatsoever things are pure. So when we think about purity, we're thinking about getting the sin out of your life. Sin can be dirty, can be yucky. When you drink water, imagine if you went to drink a cup of water and it was all brown. You'd be like, ew, that's not very pure, is it? <laughs> but when you think of pure, you want it to be clean, righteous, no sin. And so thinking on things that are pure, we don't want to think about sin, we want to think, be thinking about things that are pure. Whatsoever things are lovely. We know what love is. You know what love? Yeah, and you love your parents, and you love your parents, you might obey your parents, you might do something nice for your parents. So love is when you're thinking of others, right? more than you're thinking about yourself. What sort of things are lovely? You're doing good things for other people. Oh, you can't really see this one. What sort of things are of good report? So these are things where you want to be able to tell other people about them, positive things that you want to talk, tell other people. Good report. So we see here, hey, he wants to see that Things are going well. Things are on the up and up, aren't they? In here, so what sort of things are of good report? Virtue. If there be any virtue, you know virtue. Virtue is when things are good, things are righteous. So we've got a big thumbs up here. Hopefully you're helping you to remember these. I'm going to test you later, so I hope you're paying attention. Virtue. And if there be any... Praise! We know praise, right? Praise is when you congratulate somebody, you recognize somebody, or you lift them up. Sometimes we praise God in our songs when we praise. If there be any praise, and the last thing the Bible says is think on these things. So these are the sort of things we want to think about. Not the negative things, the positive things, like the Bible talks about. So let's see how many we remember. Maybe this will help us to remember the verse as well. So how does it, just sit down, sit down, you're a good girl. It's finally, brethren, whatsoever things are, Timothy, true. true. Whatsoever things are, you remember the picture? You make a deal, what does it, what does it need? Honesty, right, honest. <laughs> whatsoever things are honest. Okay, whatsoever things are, remember a judge, justice, just. just, yeah, that's fair, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are, what's not dirty, yeah. pure, Very good, whatsoever things are, <gasps> lovely, very good, whatsoever things are lovely, Whatsoever things are of, who remembers this one? The only. Remember this one? Whatsoever things are of good, good report. Very good, Zephy. Whatsoever things are of good report. If there be any virtue, right? If there be any virtue, and if there be any, what's this one? Right? Let's choose somebody else. This one? Praise. Very good. Think on these things. Very good. See? Let's read this one together. Philippians 4, 8. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, Whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these things. Okay. Now we do have a craft today, but oh, we are just in time. That's your cue to enter. Do you have a sample that I can show the kids? Oh, look at this. Very good. Now today. Philip has brought in all the different mag all these magazines. And we're going to look through the magazines and we're going to find things that make us happy, things that are positive. So we've got some things on here that Philip has put together. And here's our verse. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, I won't read it all. What are some things that make Philip happy and positive? Oh, look at this. 
It's a nice cold drink there. Yeah. I got a puppy dog who likes puppies. Yeah, puppies. Oh, we got God's word. Yeah, whatsoever things are true, or God's word. Oh, what about this nice setting in the mountains? Doesn't that look nice? Nature. What about honey? Who likes honey? You like honey? Yeah, okay. All right, so we're going to look through the maze. So let's all stand up. We're going to go to the back. We're going to put one of these together.